Good morning and welcome to WJZ.com. It is a warm, humid, and very still look at the waters of the inner moving toward outer, outer harbor. Start to this day. Let's take a look at temps around right now. The average is in the mid 50s, and right now we're anywhere from 7 to 10 degrees above that average overnight low. Twin highs are just shoveling all this humidity and morning warmth, what will be afternoon heat, up the entire East Coast. And already, look at the line of showers and thunderstorms breaking out ahead of this frontal boundary as it cruises across the country and comes slamming into the mid-Atlantic later on. This is a fairly significant change in the afternoon, evening, and nighttime outlook. Storm Prediction Center has upped us from marginal to a slight risk of severe weather as we move through that time period, which will begin at about 3 o'clock. We'll see showers and thunderstorms blossoming. And then that will continue as we move through dinner and then into the, uh, into the uh, bedtime hours. Overnight, we'll get some clearing. Tomorrow, no real issues around, but we're still looking for energy moving our way to give us at least the first half of the holiday weekend. And I, I count Friday as part of a holiday weekend. I look at them as four-day weekends. Friday and Saturday, uh, gray, cool, and damp, wet at times. 93, your high this day. Overnight tonight, warm. 67 degrees will be the low. Tomorrow, again, pretty nice day, 88. Then rain arrives 70 on Friday, 64 Saturday. A lot of Saturday is going to be in the upper 50s. Partly sunny, 68 Sunday. Monday is going to, and, and, and let's, let's talk about Sunday real quick. We may start with some shower activity and gray skies, but by the time we get to the afternoon and evening, should be okay. Monday, definitely overall the best of the weekend days. 78 is the high, 82 some sun on Tuesday. Thank you so much for stopping by WJZ.com.